Jim channel and I'm Jesse Smith your host and today today guys we are going to be doing animation blur okay so this is Photoshop I'll be using we'll be using three frames I'll start on the first frame I'll start on the wall Kind of speed it up a little bit and as you can see i have some i'm putting little dots to show a guide for the first placement of the first frame and i'm going to start from the first frame i'm going to use the first frame and rotate it and use it as a guide for the third frame for the fifth placement on the wall and to manipulate it a little bit to make it its own frame then from these two frames frame one and three I will get the blur Our second frame will be the blur frame, but I'm going to, after I create the first frame, I will be creating the third frame. This frame one, it's going to be on twos. This is frame two, it's going to be on ones. Frame three, it's going to be on twos. And the next two are two, frame two is the blur frame and then it goes back to frame one. And that's what makes the loop. And you can see that there's a blur in just the three frames. And of course, the blur comes from the second frame. And it, of course, I, I say you have to add more frames. I mean, everybody's gonna say that. You gotta add more frames to make it more smoother. But right now I'm just showing you, you know, the basic, the technique, kind of what is in the book that I'm talking about, the animator survival kit, great book. There it is, guys. Blur animation of a fist pounding. So that's about it, guys.